stuff that you might want to know about. We are right now in Washington, D.C. and uh, at the have some beautiful Museum, Museum of the Bible. Of the Bible. It's a great Look at place. this theater. Look at this. Museum of the Bible. We're, we're going to be talking I about feel something. Jesus. <laughs> I feel him all the time. He's on my present. And, uh, but I tell you, we're going to be talking about something that's really exciting. And we got a special announcement to make here in a few minutes. But we, let us tell you what we've been doing today. We've had a crazy day. Okay. Yes. Uh, we've all been running different ways in different places, and it's just been crazy. I've been in North Carolina for five days producing a record for my buddies. And Amber and Nathan have been working on all kinds of stuff. Kelly. We've been taking care of the cows and the horses. She's been taking care of the cows and the horses. Going to every Braves game there ever has she been. She does go to a she lot of Braves games. She doesn't miss a Braves game. And uh, what have you been doing all week? We're moving to a new That's house. That's right. You and Jamie are moving, and she is with child. Okay? <laughs> and so there's a lot going on. And so last night we all, uh, we, we get home, we get to bed after midnight. We had after? this really nice plane. That's, it's a real it's a plane. Pilatus, it's a Pilatus. A Pilatus. So we had a plane call this morning. And so... First time that's ever happened. Yeah. <laughs> well, one time when you were little, we flew yeah, one uh, time. out west. Yeah. But, so we had a private uh, plane bring us to Washington because we're doing some stuff uh, here this weekend for... Road to Majority Conference. Road to Majority Conference. <laughs> and, Are uh, you like that? Puppeteer? I guess so. Yeah, I got a hand behind my back. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to be singing uh, tomorrow. We're singing the national anthem. And, and then it. we're going to be debuting our brand new single that some of you may have heard called There's a Hole in the Heart. And uh, it was written by Bill Gaither and Larry Gatlin. Yes. And uh, I love that song so much. And for and the first time this weekend, we actually have t-shirts. Yes. We have t-shirts with the song lyrics on the shirt. Them. I know. So we put them out on the table for all the folks here in Washington, D.C. at the Road to Majority Conference. So if you happen to be watching the Facebook page right now, please stop by our booth and come grab one. Yeah. Hole in the Heart merch. You, you heard it here. But speaking of Bill Gaither, okay, so do me a favor real quick. Go down, hit the like button, and hit the share button. That's how you can help us get the words out. Don't be worried about the lights because we're getting ready to film some uh videos here so they're working on some stuff but this year the week of september the 11th the dates are actually september the 10th through the 13th through the 13th we <laughs> are bringing many of you here to washington dc we call this hello everyone it is third news has the gospel community mourns the tragic death of the nuns one of the gospel music families in america the Nolans were involved in a tragic fatal plane crash on Friday afternoon when they were on their way to join their friends the Gaither homecoming cruise which was scheduled to be in Alaska. The news has been confirmed by different social media posts whereby a caption of their photos and various videos have been posted on social media handles. The social media post from Georgia Governor Brian Kemp also mentioned that the three members who also died from an Atlantic family gospel group in Wyoming brain crash has also sparked sadness among the followers and gospel music lovers around the world. It's really sad that the tragedy they were a very good member Christian family who have been composing several songs and music which has helped to spread the word of God. Let us take this opportunity to send our condolences to their family and also to all gospel musicians around the world and all the family members for such a tragic death. It's really sad and heartbreaking to hear such heartbreaking information. Investigations by the civil aviation are still ongoing on to know what caused the crash. A formal statement has been issued from the Gaither Management Group on social media, 
whereby they shared the information regarding this plane crash on social media. An official statement from the Gaitha management group was also posted on Facebook saying one of the best loved gospel music families in America, the Nerons were involved in a tragic fatal plane crash on Friday afternoon on their way to join the Gaitha homecoming cruise to Alaska. Killed in the crash were Jason and Kerry Neron Crack, Amber and Nathan Kestra, and their assistant. Married Ages, along with the pilot Larry Hain and his wife Marissa. The National Transportation Safety Board is investigating the accident. Autumn, Jason, and Kerry's youngest daughter, and her husband. Jimmy Streetman were not on the plane and and arrived safely into Seattle and were notified of the accident. They were brought to the hotel where artists were gathered with Bill and Gold together to pray, sing and embrace them in their grief, preaching support from the whatever needs arise. Autumn and Jimmy will return home for now to Kerry's brother Todd Neron and his wife Rhonda to begin the hard tasks that are lie ahead. Please keep them, the Chrysler family, the Hain family and the family of Merrill Hedges in your prayers. And also an official statement from Otan Neron Streetman also she had the information of the tragic death whereby she had this to say as many of you have heard by now my father and mother Jason and Kelly Neron Clark along with my sister Amber and brother-in-law Nathan as well as our dear friends Merrod Hedges Rory and Marissa hey were involved in a tragic plane crash on Friday Thank you for the prayers that have been extended already to me, my husband Jimmy, and our son to be born, baby boy, as well as Jason parents. Dan and Rinda Crack, we appreciate your kind prayers, love and support as we navigate the coming days, signed by Neron Streetman. Here on this channel, we also send our condolences to the family for losing such a wonderful singing group and also we pray that god gives you courage and strength in this trying moment of losing such an incredible singing group such the lovers of christ the faithful who have lost their souls today rest in peace the neurons